17 Health Watch now. Valentine's Day is right around the corner. A day of love, romance, gifts, and feelings of togetherness. But along with those feelings can come an unwanted companion, sexually transmitted diseases. 17's Michaela Armstrong spoke with local experts about how to protect yourself while celebrating this day of love. Michaela? Tammy, according to the experts, when you're celebrating Valentine's Day, consider adding getting tested to the list. Or if you're exposed to an STD, this could affect you all your life. Eva Garcia, community health educator at Aventus Health, says Valentine's Day may be a day of love, but it can also come with a price. As a result of the day, there can be an increase in sexually transmitted diseases. We have seen an increase uh, on these special days like Valentine's, where our cases of STDs are coming in more frequent. According to Kern County Public Health's latest numbers, in 2021, there were more than 5,000 cases of chlamydia, more than 2,000 cases of gonorrhea, more than 1,200 cases of syphilis, and in 2022, there were 200 cases of HIV. Program manager Patrick Salazar says this trend is happening all over. All around nationally, statewide, and even locally, the numbers are, are just, what we're seeing is they're really high. Um, so it's a trend that we're seeing all around. According to Garcia, some of the most affected groups are women, African Americans, and Latinos, and a rapidly growing population of youth. She says changing the stigma around sexual health could help. It's important to teach our children at a young age and talk about your, your body parts, about your sexuality, because eventually once they reach their teen years, um, they need to be open with you. And if you have that communication early on, it helps them communicate that information to you. Garcia says the best gift is getting tested and putting your health first this Valentine's. If you think you're at risk, come and see us. We are here to talk to you regarding um, STDs. To find more information out about how you can go get tested, go to KGT.com. Michaela Armstrong, 17 News.